guys welcome back to another video I know I said that I would start making videos again and I uploaded that video on New Year's Eve and here we are almost the end of May finally posting but college is hard so yeah so I was inspired by oh I'm using my phone to film I'm going to insert the picture I'm inspired by right here yeah um it was super gorgeous to me I thought it would be really fun to recreate because I'm kind of iffy about recreating stuff uh, but this is what I really wanted to do and while I'm making this intro sorry if you can hear I have two fans in my room because it's upstairs and it gets super hot up here so this is the finished product it's not perfect but I didn't use eyeliner because it's very hard for a lot of people to do like wings, including myself. Plus I like my eyes in particular without eyeliner because I feel like they're very big. I don't wanna make them smaller with, you know, using eyeliner. I hope you guys enjoy the video and subscribe for more. Uh, comment down below if you want me to um, do a tutorial on like my everyday face makeup because I did not put that in the tutorial only the eyes the glow and the lips so I started off with my eyebrows done and then I took my James Charles palette and I used these two shades and I just started buffing those into my crease and I'm just gonna do a gradient of like brown to more orangey coral tones so I, then I mixed these two colors and started blending that above the first colors that I put down just to make it very warm and orangey. Now I'm taking this purple shade in the palette and I'm just going to start applying that all over my lid but I'm not going to pack it on and then I'm going to take the berry shade in the palette right here and I'm going to use that on the outer V just to further deepen the colors to kind of mesh the orange and the purple together. Then finally, just to add a brighter pop of orange, I'm going to add the lighter orange. I didn't point to it very well, but the lighter orange just on top of all the colors just so we don't lose that bright orange. Now I'm going to take a ColourPop Supernova shadow and this is a really pretty like iridescent blue purple color and this is just a liquid eyeshadow with a doe foot applicator so I thought it would be super pretty to add some dimension to this look and then I just took that same brush I used to put on the purple eyeshadow just to blend those together. Now I'm taking a ColourPop Super Shock shadow in the shade Eye Candy. My camera wouldn't focus on it but I tried to show you as best I could and this is just a light icy purple so I just applied this in the inner corner. This is all of the eyeshadow done before I put anything under the lash line and I did the rest of my face and everything else off camera just because this was an eye tutorial and now I'm using my L'Oreal telescopic mascara this is my favorite drugstore mascara it lengthens your lashes so much and it clumps but in the good way because I'm pretty sure it has little fibers in it that just lengthen your lashes up to Jesus when I put mascara on my lower lash line I always seem to get it under my eye so I hate my life <laughs> um, but then I just took some of that berry color mixed with the purple and just put that underneath my lash line just to bring everything together. Now I'm taking a ColourPop Luster Dust in the shade Strobe Glow and this is just a loose highlighter. I really love it, especially when it's applied wet during the summertime. But I just used a little basic fan brush and just put this on my cheekbones like you do with highlighter and I put some on my nose and it was like super bright um, 
But yeah, this is just super awesome and I definitely recommend them. Now I'm just going to take a MAC lipstick in the shade Spirit and a ColourPop lip gloss and I'm just going to apply the lipstick first and put the lip gloss on top because I thought it would be super gorgeous to finish this look. This is the finished look with everything completed. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and subscribe for more. Leave me video requests down in the comments below and give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Bye!